after Paul, how does it feel? You know, we, we've now you've you've done it. You've you've done the hundredth. I've been a weight lifted off my shoulders, to be honest with you. Yeah. yeah. Um, I didn't know how long it would take to get well. From number 99 to 100, it could have been uh, dragging on for ages on my mind, you know, affecting my shooting. But uh, thankfully, I shot uh, 100, 300 um, one Saturday, and then the following Saturday, which is two Saturdays ago, yeah. uh, I shot the other one. So it was only uh, hanging on my shoulders for a week, really. <laughs> and you shot the 100th and first at Mid Wales? At Mid Wales, oh. uh, the first day of the Krieg Off. Um, not the actual Krieg Off main two days, but on the prelim events on the Thursday. Yeah, we rattled our uh, number 101. <laughs> and, and how special is the Kriegoff DTL? Oh, it's very special to me. Um, been um, a Kriegoff sponsored shooter um, since 2005. Uh, all that Kriegoff have done for me and what have you. It's just nice to go there, uh, be a presence of it. Uh, they make you feel so welcome. Um, and it's just one of those things you like to be in attendance and shoot well just to uh, re try and repay them for all that they've done for us over the years. And. With your 100, 300, can you remember your first? Yeah, believe it or not, <laughs> uh, it's at, it was at this actual ground we're at now, uh, the North of England Clay Target Centre in York, uh, way back in April 2003. Mm. And did that, did that feel as special as your 100th? It did actually, um, because it was it happened in very short space of time. Really, um, I shot my first uh, registered DTL event in November. 2002 and then six months later to shoot your first 100 300 um i was overwhelmed by it mm. what what's the one tip you would give to somebody taking taking up dtl get a gun that fits you make sure the gun shoots where you look get the fundamentals right before you start chasing around allocating around the country get your gun to shoot where you look and then then it's down to yourself then so paul i understand at the krieg off you had a, a very special gift yeah it was a bit of a shock actually um just at the end of the Lucky Numbers show, Peter Brass um, asked me to come up on stage, and so to speak, and I thought it was to draw the, do the Lucky Numbers draw or something, and I was amazed. Um, he'd had made uh, prior, uh, he'd had it on the, <laughs> on the, on, in his boardroom for six months, he said, because he didn't know when the 100 was going to come. Uh, he'd actually had a, a one-off Kriegoff commissioned ring um, made for me uh, to celebrate the 100, 100, 300s, which was uh, overwhelming, actually.